Hey, what's going on guys? Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome to part 75 of Pokemon Emerald. Last time, I caught the only Sudowoodo in the game, and I also caught a Smeargle and a Ditto. This time, I'm going to begin my second run against the Elite Four by rematching Sydney and Phoebe. So, let's go ahead and get this started. So first off, I am going to stock up on some items, even though I don't think I really have to do that, since I've barely used any items after beating the Elite for the first time, but whatever, it's good to be prepared. So anyways, let's see, Ultra Balls, I don't need to worry about those. Hyper Potions, let's see, I have 52, so I think I will go with 18. And yeah, I like to have an even number of items, just because I feel more prepared that way, if that makes any sense at all. Uh, max potions, I don't have to worry about. Full restores, let's see. I have 22. I think I'm going to actually stick with that because, well, I, they're they're really expensive. And, yeah, so I don't, yeah, I'm just going to leave it at 22. Full heals, uh, I have 100 full heals, so I don't think I have to buy any more of those. Uh, revives, I have 43. So let's go with, let's go with 17 to, to get an even 60. And max pals, I don't have to worry about. So there we go, we're all good for the items, and now I'm going to organize my team. So, let's see. So I'm going to put Betty in the front, because Sydney is the first Elite Four member. Uh, and I will take the Amy the Queen away from Nightmare. Oh, okay, my bag is full, so, um, actually, wait a second. I have to give the, have to give the leftovers back to Mustroom, because I, I, had, I had to take them away because of the, um, the the battle pyramid. So I will give them back to my storm and then that opens up space in my bag. So that works out perfectly. So I will take the amulet coin and I will give it to Betty. So there we go. And here we go guys, it is time to start my second run against the Elite Four. And you're probably wondering why I am doing this because there's really no point. It's kind of a waste of time actually. Uh, but you know what? I feel like after spending so much time in the Battle Frontier that this is the right time to do this. And what I have planned to do after I'm done with the Elite Four, it's gonna it's gonna take quite a while, probably longer than the Battle Frontier. So I think that this is the right time to do this. I think it's kind of like a like kind of like an intermission. It's kind of like a like a breather, if that makes any sense at all. Uh, I know it's kind of weird to be doing a breather in the Elite Four, but whatever. Anyways, here we go. Second battle against Sydney. Welcome, challenger. I am Sydney of the Elite Four. I don't really need, yeah, I don't really need to repeat this because I've already said all this, all this stuff before. So anyway, anyways, guys, here is this is Sydney. Um, we destroyed him before, and we're gonna destroy him again. Um, yeah, he's really cool. I like his red mohawk. But anyways, yeah, this is gonna be a piece of cake. Uh, I mean, Betty is twelve levels higher than his Mariana, so yeah, I'm not worried at all. I'm going to Sky Uppercut. So yeah, guys, I was actually playing, um, I was playing this game earlier today, um, like, like my, n like, not this exact, uh, game, like, my personal copy, and, um, my Swampert in that game, it, it, his name is David, and he was, like, really close to level, uh, to level, eight, um, 80, he was level 79, and he was, like, a thousand experience points away from level 80, and, uh, so I battled, um, I had a rematch against Wally, got him to level 80, and then I... Uh, battle the, the Elite Four again, or at least the first four members, not the, like, not Wallace. Um, and now he's, like, level 82 or 83, I don't even remember. Um, but, yeah, I still have the 11 rare candies. Like, I use all the rare candies in this game, but in that game, I haven't used any of them. Uh, so, once I get him to level 89, I might just use all 11 rare candies and then get him to level 100, and then transfer all of my Pokemon down to Heart Gold or Diamond or whatever, and then just restart and play through the game again, because I haven't played through this game, like, on my own time since summer of 2016. So, yeah. I think it'd be a good time to do that. Anyways. Oh, great, you're just gonna spam Double Team? It's such a- man, it's such a cheap move. Okay. Okay, you don't need to do this! Seriously? Come on, flamethrower. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Actually, I should be saying come on my laptop, not but come on, flamethrower. Anyways. There we go. Let's 
And Crawdon is next. We will go over to Voltzer. So guys, I actually bought a new game today. Yeah, I bought New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe for the Switch. Which is really, really pointless for, for me to buy that because I already own New Super Mario Bros. 1, 2, Wii, U, and New Super Luigi U. Um, yeah. So this is this is the sixth game in, in that entire series that has that has been released. It released on um re released on Friday on the eleventh. And uh yeah, and so I don't need to buy to buy the Switch version, but I did anyways because I had $150 worth of EB Games gift cards. So um like I uh so like I, I had a hundred dollar gift card plus I had two twenty five dollars uh, Two twenty-five dollar gift cards. So I thought, you know what? Like, there's no. They, they were completely sold out of Amiibos. There's no new new games that are going to be released anytime soon that I'm interested in. So I thought, you know what? I might as well just buy this game. You know, I'm going to play. I'm going to beat it. It's not like it's a complete waste of uh, a complete waste of, uh, of money or, or time. And and you know, I mean, it might be a waste of time. But I mean, you know, like it's not like I'm not like I actually spent ninety dollars on the game. Like I had the gift card, right? So you know, I, I don't know. I just thought it'd be be nice. I still haven't beaten, uh, I still haven't beaten Let's Go Pikachu, and I feel like I have, I, I have, I, like, I've played quite a bit of Smash Ultimate, but I feel like there's a lot, like, I feel like I should, like, I haven't played in yeah, a few days, actually, so I feel like I should play that again. Um, but anyways, we've beaten Sydney, so now it's time to take on Phoebe, and yes, I'm gonna be doing this twice as fast as before, because, well, yeah, you know, there's no point of doing, of battling each trainer, uh, you know, one video at a time, because you guys have already seen this, so, yeah. Anyways. <clears throat> but yeah, I've actually barely played any of New Super Mario Bros. Wii. Like, I should, that's a game I should actually try to beat. I've beaten the first one, I've beaten the second one, I've beaten you, and I've beaten Luigi U. Um, so the only two I haven't beaten are uh, U Deluxe, obviously, because I just bought it today, and uh, Wii. So yeah. Anyways, here we go, this is Phoebe. Yeah, th this music is really epic. I really like the Elite Four music. I like how it's completely different from the Gym Leader music. Anyways, guys, guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna use Sora's Dance because he's gonna use Protect, or she's gonna use Protect, because she, she, she does it pretty much every single time. I think there was one time recently, I actually might have been, I don't even remember, it might have been when, uh, when I battled her the first time, but there was one time I was playing this recently, I don't know if it was this or my person or my uh like my personal copy but there was one time where she actually didn't use protect and it threw me off and then she, she of course she uses it again uh but it threw me off because she almost always does that it's just, like there's like an 85 percent chance that she's going to use protect on the first turn possibly the second turn like she did for me just then but yeah it's really annoying because um it's really annoying because you know uh Desclops has pressure so you're you're the all the, the power points that you use, all the PP that you use, it, it, it's used twice as fast. So it's kind of annoying. Uh, but then we will stay in. And please don't heal. Of course you're gonna heal! Go. Okay, next up is Sableye, so I'm gonna go over to Mudstorm. It's nice to actually be getting experience points. Um, you know, because like in the Battle for Tier, you don't your Pokemon don't get experience points. So it's nice to be actually it's nice to finally be getting experience points here. And Mudstorm is finally gonna get the level 63. Finally, like man oh man, every time I sent him out in the Battle Frontier. It was like, oh, he's gonna get to level 63. Oh, wait a second, no, he's not, because I'm in the Battle Frontier. So, yeah. So, there we go. Finally! Level 63. That, 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 that looks really, really nice. Alright, Bennett, uh, let's see. Let's go over to my laptop and just use, just use Overheat. And hopefully that, that will one-shot it. Thunderbolt. There we go. And 
Last up is her final Dusclops, and I am going to go back to Mudstorm. Yeah, and then, uh, of course, in this game, um, the, uh, like, the Elite Four, like, you can rematch them like I'm doing right now, but their teams are exactly the same. Their Pokemon are the exact same, their levels are the, are the exact same, like, um, there's no, like, actual, like, rematch, like, they're, like, like their teams are, com are, com are the exact same, because in some games, um, like in Fire Red Leaf Green, Heart Gold to Silver, Platinum, I believe, X, no, 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 X, Y, uh, Sun and Moon, uh, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, and Black and White 2, I believe, uh, all, I think all those games have a actual Elite Four rematches where you can battle them and their teams are different, but this game is not one of them. But I still think it's fun to come back and battle them again. Anyways, we defeated Phoebe. And... That is it, guys. So, I am already halfway to the champion. So, next time, I'm going to rematch Glacia and Drake. So, stay tuned for that. Thank you guys very much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you all next time. Peace!